about Jamaica, baby. They made me to be the greatest. Serving the deed of my creators. Fresh off of my high haters. It's the king again. Magdalene, Sophie, bragging and boasting. Yo, what up, y'all? It's your boy Dollars. Welcome back to the channel. It's another day, another dollar video. And I'm going to be reacting to episode 7 of My Hero Academia. I believe is about to go down between Deco and Kachan. And if I'm going to make a prediction, I think Deku might hold his own for a little while until Kachan defeats him. Because even though Deku got his powers recently, he still hasn't mastered it. He's still working on things. Like, he hasn't fully mastered his power. And, you know, if, if he goes all out, he could die. So that's one thing that's interesting about this show is they give him this power that can be potentially OP. But at the same time... He can't fully use it because if he does then you know he could kill himself or others so i wonder how as the story progresses how he's gonna learn to control that power so that he can use it and not really be a danger to himself and other people around him anyway without further ado let's hop right into this hey do you really think Deku has a quirk? You saw how he threw that ball. Was he seriously just tricking me all these years? I'm gonna roast that damn nerd today! <laughs> I wonder why Kachan takes this shit so personally. Like, what does it matter that Deku has a quirk? Not to mention his quirk. They're all so much greater than mine. But that just means that I have to do better. I refuse to lose today. All right, let's begin the indoor combat. I hope Deku's costume gets cooler. I'm not really feeling the bunny ears. What's the matter, Deku? Afraid to stand up and fight me? I won't hurt you so bad they'll have to stop the fight. Just close. <laughs> He's been studying, bro. I like that about Deku too. He studies all the greats, his opponents. You can call me Deku, but I'm not the same helpless, defenseless kid anymore. You hear me? I've changed. From now on, Deku is the name of a hero. <laughs> so we've known each other since we were little kids. kids followed him around it seemed like he could do anything it would have been interesting if they were actually friends though in the beginning i thought he was the coolest person i'd ever met <laughs> however after his quirk manifested he started to change he became more of an asshole you're shaking in your boots you're so scared but you want to fight me anyway that's why i hate you <laughs> What? All men are not created equal. He hates when Deku because Deku old, won't back down from him. Have more power than others. Like who is you, fam? Why should I fucking bow down to you? You're nobody. Hello? He hung up on me. This isn't the time for radio silence. We're supposed to be partners. Ugh. Hey, who is Bakugo talking to? That character looks like a Gundam. Wrapping this around your opponent means you've apprehended them and they're out for the rest of the game. So there's a 15 minute time limit and the good guys have no idea what floor the nuclear weapon is hidden on, right? Correct. Then the heroes are clearly at a disadvantage here. A big one. Real pros have to outwit villains on a daily basis. I mean, that's what it's like in most freaking comic book stories. The heroes against all type of odds that you don't think he's going to survive. Monsieur, he's on the move. Huh? <sighs> Yeah, I was just gonna say, send her off to go after the nuke and just fight Kachan. What will Kachan do now? Knowing him, he'll be impatient and try another big punch. I was right. The little guy's really good. He's holding his. That reminds me of the Batman. When Batman is fighting, he's thinking in his head about his moves and shit like that. He internalized everything he learned. Those lessons are in his blood now. 
That fanboy knowledge is paying off. For real. <laughs> Bring him forward. He kicked first this time. He's switching things up so I can't predict his moves. Does that mean he's worried? Get back here, Deku! I mean, running is always a viable option, right? <laughs> I'm to fight him at close range now. I need some kind of plan. I wonder how he's going to use his power in this situation. Because eventually you got to use your power, right? Weak! Bet you've been laughing behind my back, huh? Oh, so where's that flashing power of yours now? <laughs> Let's see how it compares to mine. Worker, no, you'll never beat me, Deku! That guy has some real anger issues. For real. <laughs> he needs some anger management. Bakugo thinks very highly of himself, but this level of pride is something else. Mm. It may end up being his demise. Foreshadowing? He might be a villain later on, man. Good. He's completely forgotten about my partner. Just like I thought. If they wanted to send someone out to stop us here, it should have been Ida. Yeah, he definitely looked like a Gundam. That probably means Kachan's gone rogue. The two of them aren't working together as a team. If we had to take those two on head to head, our chances of winning would be- You got a better chance of winning now. I can't go after the weapon right now or Kachan will follow me. And if we both tried to take him down, we'd probably run out of time. Hmm. So we stay split up for now. I have to trust Uraraka. She'll find the weapon and Ida, and then I'll join her for a two on one fight. That's how we'll win. I'll just have to capture- Sounds like a good strategy. I can do it. As long as I don't get too close to his hands. Stop hiding! <sighs> Come on and face me, you coward! Hmm. By the way, I've been meaning to tell you, Kachan. You're even worse than the rest of these rejects. You really think they let someone like you in when they could have me? Don't oh, wait! I'm not trying to compete against you! You gotta believe me! I take back everything I said. Okay. My son Deku getting confident now. I like to see that. Like it or not, you can't stop me! From now on, Deku's the name of a hero! He's just a little bug. <laughs> wow, you're so awesome! Whatever, this is nothing. Uh-oh. <laughs> Jesus, Zuku. You really can't do anything right, can you? Look, you can read the last part of his Zuku's name is Deku. <laughs> Whoa, so you can read that? Well, obviously. Deku. That must be what you call a helpless loser who's completely useless. <laughs> wow. Being so mean, Kachan. Why don't you understand? He used to look up to him too, wanted to be his friend. Dude, that has to be a new record. I bet it is. Wow. <laughs> cool. Where's yours? Mm. Well, uh, it sank. <laughs> <laughs> and they laughing like they could do any better. There's always the ones on the sidelines laughing and shit. Impressive. I bet you that's going to grow into an amazing quirk. Definitely. A flashy quirk for a future hero. It's perfect. Yeah. Does Kachan have any family? Like, why is he so freaking messed up? I bet there's no one as great as I am. Wow. Yeah, he got super villain written all over him, bro. Kachan, when I get mine, I hope it's just as cool. Whatever, Deku. No matter what power you end up with, you'll never be able to beat me. Hmm. A worthless bug for me to smash. Hey, did you hear? Deku doesn't have a quirk like none. What? Really? Yeah, wow. it's called being quirkless. That's dumb. What? Quirkless rhymes with worthless. That's the funny thing. Forward march and here we go. Members of the agency Bakugo. Sound off. Oh. Hey, you okay down there? Oh, don't worry. Kachan is super tough. See? Nah. I was just fine on my own, Deku. Hurry, get back up here. Sure. Just give me one second. I <laughs> didn't need your stupid help. Deku was trying to save him. Are you all right? Are you hurt? Aww. I was worried you might have hit your head or something. But you looked at me like I was some kind of weakling. Kachan, I couldn't just stand there and watch you die. Like you. Even after all the years of bullying, he still tries to help him. Found it. Now I just have to tell Deku. 
and try my best to stay out of sight until he gets up here. Bakugo definitely has a villainous side, mm. and that's exactly what we need to succeed in this mission. Hmm. I need to temporarily devote myself to criminal intent. Yes, I won't fail this. He's such a good guy that it's hard for him to be a villain. That means I must now embrace evil to become a hero. Mm. Behold, I am the personification of villainy. <laughs> <laughs> is that you? I knew you would come here alone the instant that Baka he even got a villain voice. It's hilarious. You to float anything that you touch, but I prepared for that by hiding every object in this room so you have nothing to use against me, do gooder. My dastardly. I mean, she could still touch you. You've blundered, hero. <laughs> he really is playing the part. <laughs> um, Deku? I'm here. How's it going? Ida knows that I'm here. Sorry. I'm right now he's monologuing. Mastermind. Where are you? Near the mm -hmm. middle of the fifth floor. Like a true supervillain does, they monologue and talk. Tell you their plan. We have to finish this fast or they win. Mm. I won't give up yet. I can capture Kachan. I won't lose. Is he really gonna catch him? Capture him though? I'm all loaded up. What does that mean? Why aren't you using your fancy quirk? Don't tell me you're underestimating me, Deku. Get over here and show me. I think that's the last thing he's doing, bro. I have no choice. I have to face him right now. Kachan, I'm not scared of you anymore. That's gonna piss him off even more. Since you're such a stalker, by now you probably know how my quirk explosion works. I secrete nitroglycerin like sweat from my hands and make it blow up. Imagine what I could do if I had a lot of it. Bro, are you trying to kill him? Gauntlets aren't just for show. They've been storing up my sweat inside for one monster blast. Wow. He's going too far. Young Bakugo, don't do it. You could literally kill him, bro. Oh. I feel like that's going to activate Come Deku's in. power somehow. In, like in order for him to survive, his power has to manifest. Nah, he took that shit head on. Is that even allowed? Bro, he ate that. Go ahead. Use your stupid quirk on me, Deku. I mean, at this point, Deku, you have no choice. You got to use your quirk. It's like survival. <laughs> Bakugo, answer me. What is going on down there? Did you cause that blast? Give Now's my chance. Now. If I can claim the weapon, that means we win. <laughs> Not so fast, hero. Jump over him. I just have to touch the weapon. In one move, this will all be over. Since when can she make herself float? <laughs> I don't think she's going to be able to grab it. Ah, damn. Good try, though. Admirable attempt, but your quirk's no threat if you can't touch anything. I could easily keep this weapon out of your reach until time runs. And he can run around, too, so she can't even touch him. The gauntlets make it so he can use his powers at long range. I'm not safe even if I stay away from him. So what do I do? Hmm. Come in. What's the situation? It's not good. <laughs> Are you ignoring me again? I'll get your attention. Sir, is it this getting out of hand? Kacha is like that mentally Bakugo unstable, bro. <laughs> exactly. To employ such a strong attack indoors is inviting the destruction of the stronghold you should be protecting. That's a poor strategy, whether you're a hero or a villain. True. Penalty would be a massive loss of points. <laughs> I know that as a teacher, I should stop this fight now. But... Nah, you can't stop that. The pillar by the window. Find Get there now. We'll fight hand to hand. It's no good. I can't dodge this. I'll have to counterattack. Like this. Oh shit! Yo, he hit him with a regular punch. He doesn't come off as a guy with a strategy, but he's actually quite intelligent. 
What are you talking about? He changed his trajectory while in midair using a blast that doubled as a smoke screen. Very clever. A faint attack like that requires an extreme amount of precision. He had to calculate the physics and demonstrate control over his quirk. Yeah, Bakugo is uber talented. I hate it. Here it comes, nerd! The famous right hook you were whining about! Deku! Don't you ever forget what you are! Damn! Yo, is Deku ever gonna land a punch? He's not giving me any time to form a strategy. I can't beat him without a quirk after all. He's too good. I mean, yeah, I don't think you could beat anybody without a quirk. I have to use it. This is hard to watch. All he has to do is wrap tape around him, not kill him. Bakugo's certainly acting like a villain. I thought Midoriya was pretty amazing at the start of the fight, but he's completely outmatched in terms of combat power. Not to mention Bakugo seems like a natural at all this stuff. <laughs> a natural born villain. What? For his sake, I'll let it go on. Yeah, that would crush his pride and ego. Make him lose his confidence. You've been hiding your true power for years! What's the deal, Deku? Did you think you were better than me this entire time? That's what you think? You gonna you beat idiot. him with kindness? You've always been stronger, Kachan. I know that you're better than me! Can't you see? That's why I want to beat you! Because you're amazing! You're even more of an idiot than I realized! Come at me! The only other time I hear that much passion in his voice is when he talks about being a hero. Mm. In order to achieve his dream, he has to do this. Not for me, but for himself. Mm. He's gonna hit the gauntlet or punch him in his face? Don't tell me he's gonna stop the fight. Both of you stop! Uraraka, no! Right! I can't beat you. Not in a one-on-one -on -one fight like this. But I can win! He just destroyed the whole building, bro. Hey yo. Good shit. This was your big plan from the very beginning, wasn't it? You were playing me this entire time, you bastard! I wasn't going to use it because I can't control it. My body just can't handle the backlash of my power yet. Mm. Mr. Aizawa said I'd be useless, but this was all that I could think of. <laughs> this is the only way I had any chance at winning. <laughs> Don't tell me Kachan's gonna feel bad for him or he's gonna start respecting him, which I would like to see that. I don't know. I don't. It's cool to have a rival, but I respect when rivals become friends. Hey. All right, yeah, that was the reaction. Um, I thought that was a dope episode. I kind of wish it was a little bit more of Deku fighting, but at this point, you know, he really can't control his power. And if he does use it, it's going to destroy his body. So he has to think of clever ways to use his power in order to be successful and still get the job done, which he did. Ultimately, y'all can say whatever you want about him. You know, you could say that, oh, he's weak or whatever. But this guy always finds a way to get the job done using his power. And I feel like that's also going to make him a better hero because it's like, Oh, another thing about being a hero is not just about your power, it's about your strategy. That's like Spider-Man and Batman and like regular comic book heroes, they always got to strategize on how they're going to defeat a certain villain or overcome an obstacle that looks like they can't overcome it. 
with just their gadgets and their powers so that's also a big part of being a hero and i'm glad that they touched on that and i'm glad to see that he uses his power in creative ways but i also want to see when he's going to finally be able to master his power i can't wait to see that i can't wait to see him finally being able to let loose and just fight somebody you know go blow for blow and you know his body won't let him down but yeah i enjoyed this episode and if you guys enjoyed this reaction please drop a like leave a comment and subscribe if you want to see my full reaction consider subscribing to my patreon anyway it's your boy dollars i'm off my time goes by, they gon' raise a nigga jersey in the sky. Treat a nigga right, big dreaming all my life. Shorty wanna get some air, I go and get up when I fly. Taking off on these niggas, I retire. The minute I catch fire, I smoked them all before, just revisiting the high.